boys and girls, and welcome to my channel. Happy Valentine's Day. <laughs> I have a book that I want to share with you that talks about love, sharing, and friendship. Mr. Pout Pout Fish goes out and buys all the supplies he needs to create special Valentines for each one of his friends. But now he is concerned that he might not have enough supplies to go around for all the Valentines. Oh no. Well, let's just read and see what happens at the end of this story. The name of this story is Pout Pout Fish Special Valentine. This story is written by Wes Adams and illustrated by Isdra Moans. Let's get started. Mr. Fish was on his way home. He had been shopping for supplies to make Valentine's Day treats and cards for all his friends. His bags were heavy and he was feeling tired. <laughs> he looks a little tired too, doesn't he? He cheered up when he saw his octopus friend. Have you been to the craft store by any chance? Asked Mr. Eight. I need something to add sparkle to my valentines. Mr. Fish was pleased to share his glitter and glue with his friend. He found Miss Clam and Mrs. Squid in a fluster. They had been up all night making heart-shaped cookies. Many, many cookies. And they had run out of ingredients for icing. Oh no, that's what makes the cookies extra special, doesn't it? Mr. Fish had just what they needed. He was glad to sweeten their day and lighten his load at the same time. He had powdered sugar to make the icing, didn't he? Thank you, Pout Pout Fish, said Mrs. Squid. You've made us both happy as clams, said her baking partner. <laughs> Swimming up from the deep, deep dark, Mr. Lantern was searching for sea flowers for his valentines, but he wasn't having much luck. Uh-oh, see? Look at that awesome fish. Why don't you make some? asked Mr. Fish. Mr. Lantern said he didn't know how. Hmm. Well, let's see what happens. What do you think Mr. Fish does? Well, let's see. From his bags, Mr. Fish took scissors, construction paper, and tape. He showed Mr. Lantern how to make blooms of all shapes and sizes. Wow, how nice of Mr. Fish to show him how to make things, huh? These are perfect, said Mr. Lantern, glowing with pride. Look at all the beautiful flowers Mr. Fish helped him make. When he got home, Mr. Fish was feeling better after helping his friends. But then he realized He'd used up most of the supplies he bought to make his own valentines. Oh, he worried that his valentine's day plan would be ruined. Oh no, he's thinking he's going to come up with something. Let's see what it is. He decided to do the best he could with what he had. A few sheets of paper and some colored pencils. As he worked on his cards, he thought of special messages for each of his pals, which he wrote with loving care. There he is. 
Have a wonderful Valentine's Day, Mr. Lantern. He came up with all kinds of nice sayings. When he was almost done, he saw a passing post fish <laughs> and gave her all the valentines to deliver, except for his last one. When it was ready, he decided to deliver it himself. Ooh, I wonder who that special valentine goes to. Well, let's see. Miss Shimmer thought his homemade card was wonderful. Thank you, she said. She gave him a valentine, too. A box of candy. Yum! While they shared the treats, Mr. Fish told her about his day. It sounds like you are everyone's special valentine, Miss Shimmer said. Oh, I don't know about that, Mr. Fish said. What do you think? <laughs> well, let's see what happens next. But Miss Shimmer was right. While Mr. Fish was away from home, everyone got together to show their friend how much he meant to them. And look what they're doing. They're delivering cookies. Ah, what do you think they're doing here? Yeah, they're making a huge Valentine card, aren't they? <laughs> what great friends. Mr. Fish returned to find a Valentine's Day surprise waiting for him with a joyful message he would never forget. Happy Valentine's Day, Pout Pout Fish. We love you. Oh, that was extra special, wasn't it? Look, he's smiling. He's happy. There it is, his special sign. Happy Valentine's Day, Pout Pout Fish. We love you. And everybody signed it. Wow. What a special surprise his friends had for him. He showed everybody special love, and in the end, they thanked him and gave him some special love, didn't they? Boys and girls, thank you for joining me today in this Valentine story, Pout Pout Fish Special Valentine. And I wish you a very special Valentine's Day. Bye. Bye.